Okay, sometimes when you make histograms, there's a bit of a problem that comes up. And that is that depending on the width of the bins that you use, you can get histograms that look like they have different shapes. To overcome that, if you have a computer like R, you can make what's called a density plot, which kind of is a smoothed uh, histogram. You can see in this one, I'm looking at length of time that someone stays. This is at the uh, uh, clinic. Uh, actually includes some impossible numbers. You can't wait less than 20 minutes. And probably it's a little bit high on this one. But you, for most of the range, you can get a good idea of the shape of the distribution. In this case, looks like we have a uniform distribution through most of the range. With some drop off, some people really got in quick. And some people were extra long waiting times, but fairly uniform in, in this range. If we look at another one, you can see clearly this you might not show up in a histogram depending on how you did the uh, bin widths, but here you can clearly see that there's some skew and I don't know if I would call this bimodal or not. Certainly if this went up a little bit higher I would. Uh, that There would be a second peak even if it didn't go as high as the first one. I, I might consider that a feature of the thing, but not so much here. And here you can see left skew and again the possibility of a bump up uh, at, at this range. So this one just skewed to the left. But anyway, uh, density plots are becoming more common than histograms because they will show the shape a little bit better without being dependent on the width of the bins that you use to construct the histogram.